You must remember this A kiss is still a kiss Check this out I'll tell you what, in terms of fines, this is up there with my favorite. Whoever put the insulation bats in on the ceiling just put it over everything. So between the insulation and the ceiling was wallpaper and all sorts of things, including newspaper from the 1950s. Check this out. Position more serious in Korea. It's just when the Korean War was starting. Critical hours for Belgium. Britain som somberly faces communist threat. Look at this, not since the period after Munich when Britain began to look the Second World War in the face has the national press of this country adopted blah 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 blah. Uh, New Zealand Herald, Tuesday, August the 1st, 1950. So there you go, geopolitics aside, check out what else was in there. Woodworker, 1950. It's a magazine for woodworkers. Look, there's two editions. Look at that, television radiogram cabinet. How's that for a build? I don't see that on YouTube these days. Bro, we can actually build a radiogram, bro. Hey? We could build a radiogram. Look, a, a bullnose plane. A radiogram, is that like the original iPad or something? <laughs> yeah, that's the OG iPad. Oh, me. Oh, look, all the joins and... Oh, they definitely didn't have colouring pencils back then, eh? <laughs> Oh, look, there we oh, go. Sterling plane. The Stanley one? Oh, India oil stones. I think I've got a Norton India oil stone, to be honest. Wait, can I shoot up the road and go get that bun? Yeah. Oh, hello. Because it's just. Norton India oil stones, check it out. I have a Norton India oil stone. I break it open, bro. What is that? Sweet ass. So their business is still going well? What else is here? Perspex. Oh, an attractive wood bowl. Look at all the different joins and this is fantastic. This is great. High class woodworking tools. Oh look, the drill. Marple's chisels. What's in this one? Stanley dovetails. How cool is that? I think I'm gonna hold on to these. And even the newspaper. A little snapshot of history. Just about 70 years ago. You must remember this. A kiss is still a kiss. Oh, there's also jobs. Carpenters. Laborers. Good wages. No, they never tell you the rate. An opportunity for man to adapt himself to a trade. Wages, 10 pounds per week. This is when New Zealand was using British currency, I guess. Now, I do realize that for a lot of people, 1950 doesn't seem like that long ago. But in New Zealand, that's pretty much the beginning of time. Fucking <laughs> Set up a campfire? It's that time of day. Chef Pato. Back at it. Back at it again. It's like out of gas. Oh. oh no, it's not. It's good. Look, warning, do not operate stove when you're in plastic carry case. <laughs> but hey. You break the rules, I, I break all the rules, bro. So what's on the menu today, Chef? It's the same old, eh? You know, just eating like a broke bastard, so a bit of milk. Get that in there for the vegans. Yeah, these are the instant oats, eh? They chop them up. Oh yeah? So they you better cook. Wow. And you just stir it like that. With oh. Perfect technique. Wow, oh my gosh. And you just keep doing it. That's been another exciting <laughs> <laughs> episode of Cooking with Chef Butter. <laughs> wow, look at that guy. <laughs> wow. Because I'm a mysterious moldy, eh? Like, everybody can't wait to see my face. That's true, that's true. Tier 2, partially completed bedroom bungalow, pleasant two bedrooms, lounge, etc. For quick sale, 1,730 pounds. Also, two sections, 800 pounds each. Far oh, out. So what is that? Like, three grand you reckon? All right, let's, uh, let's get the inflation calculator out of. 1,750. 
1950 India calculate. To be honest with you, I don't really enjoy this. It's but that's quite expensive, that's 56,000 pounds. For what? For that Tiara 2 house. So it's like 100 sure. grand. So it's much cheaper than it is now. So nowadays for a house like that in Tiara 2, you'd probably pay 600? In Tiara 2? Two bedroom? More than that, I reckon. Yeah, 800? Tiara 2 stuff or north? Didn't okay. say. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh. I reckon 650 minimum. 650, so it's six and a half times. And it'll probably need, and, and, and it'll probably need to be renovated. Takapuna, 1,200 pounds. Beach side of road and only 30 yards from Takapuna Beach. How much for that one? Right by the beach, Lake Road, 1,200 yeah. pounds. For a beachside cottage in a part of Auckland that is very expensive now. Hard. That's 39,000 pounds, so that's, I always double it. I don't know if that's right, but I always double it. That's 80 grand. 80 eight, grand. 80 grand today. Far out, man. 80 grand. But you're getting paid 10 pounds a week. So, good porridge there, Chef Pato? It's alright. This is really turning into the what we find in Walls show, isn't it? Provisional application to purchase a state rental house. Guess there was no rubbish bins back then, eh? You must remember this. Another thing we found in the roof space. I think whoever made it was the same guy who had those woodworking journals. And our best guess at what it is, so far, is some sort of door jig. I don't know if you can see me in here, it's pretty dark. Perfect fit. First we thought maybe it was a hinge jig, and then we're like, maybe it's just something to hold the bottom of the door as you work on the door. Little stand. Who knows? Maybe if you've seen one of these before, you can let me know.